Good morning, middle school. I'm Steven. Now please stand as I lead you in the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the prayer. For everyone in Miss Holloway's seventh grade home room, bow your heads and pray with me. Dear God, please help them to remember the kindness they share with others. That can be the beginning of something great for anyone receiving it. Let them feel your love and kindness. In your name, we pray. Amen. Now to the anchors. Hi, I'm Sarah. Here are your middle school homeroom announcements for Monday, September twelfth, twenty sixteen. The first student council meeting of the year will be tomorrow at 7 a.m. up in McKeever. Please let Miss Lewis or Mrs. Sanchez know if you cannot attend this meeting. Listen up, 7th grade girls. Please join the high school leaders, Mrs. Foster and Mrs. Leak, to kick off this year's Bible study this Thursday, September 15th. You, can, you will get started at 715 in room 154 on the 8th grade hall. They are looking forward to sharing this time with you. Come by and give it a try. There will be an organizational 7th and 8th grade swim and dive team meeting tonight at 6.30 p.m. in Warren Hall, otherwise known as Bone Cafeteria. At this meeting, you will go over all the details and you will have the opportunity to try on and to order team swimsuits. If you're interested in swimming or diving this season, please plan, attend, please plan to attend this important meeting. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Hanlon. This is the last week for you to bring in socks. Please go shopping so you can donate new socks. This is an item that is easy for you to carry in and they are truly needed by the homeless. Please help us to fill the bin by Friday. The sock collection ends on Friday, September 16th. Also, the middle school robotics team will meet twice a week after school to practice, starting tomorrow. Remi remember to email Mr. Klein if you plan to attend. If you are a fifth or sixth grader and do not have much to do when you get out of school, here's an idea. You can stay after school and take a class to learn how to manage your money or play games on the quad. There are also classes to bake cakes, sew a button, and change a tire, all things that are fun to learn to do. For more information, send an email to Ms. Weatherly at kweatherly at westlandschool.org. This is a great way to have fun with friends after school and avoid that bored feeling. The trip to Sheltering Arms for September 14th is filled up. If you have signed up and cannot go, please tell Ms. Shepard because there are students on the waiting list who can take your place. Now for the birthdays. Hi, I'm Bennett. Today we have one birthday to announce. Happy birthday to 7th grader Naomi Neiman. We hope you have a great birthday. Now over to the Do You Know question. This week we will focus on the details of the September 11th ter terrorist attack. Here's today's do you know question. What year did the September 11th terrorist attack happen? Is it A, 1991, B, 2001, or C, 2011, or D, 2013? If you answered B, 2001, you are correct. On September 11th, 2001, a terrorist attack happened that shocked our nation. I'm sure your teachers can tell you what they were doing when they heard about this attack. Now over to the lunch. Today's soups are black bean soup and chicken noodle soup. Your hot entree choices are beef soft tacos, vegetable stuffed peppers, southwestern rice, steamed green beans, and sauteed mushrooms and peppers. And for dessert today, you will have fresh baked cookies and ice cream novelties. Thank you for watching WWTV and have an amazing day.